I'm Mark Owens. This is Mark Owens Boxing. I'm the owner and CEO of Mark Owens Boxing, the founder of True Ringleaders, a nonprofit organization that really instills and mentors the kids. Um, Mark Owens. <laughs> How did I get into boxing? Uh, fighting as a kid, one of those little kids that was always getting into fights. Uh, then I had a fight for the 50th time in school, uh, and the, the authorities were called. Uh, and this specific time, uh, charges were pressed on me. So throughout the whole judicial system, the whole juvenile process, uh, when I went to court, the court sent me to community service uh, in a boxing gym. And that's why I fell in love with boxing. What are some of my favorite boxing spots? Of course, the mob. Mark Owens Boxing is my favorite boxing spot. But outside of that, uh, in the Houston area, specifically main boxing gym. Main boxing gym has a, they have champions, they have amateurs. It's a whole, you know, collective of warriors in that gym. The, some of the greatest born that I've seen and experienced personally uh, ever. What skills do you need to be a boxer? <laughs> you gotta have hands, <laughs> you know, it, it just makes sense. But no, really you need to be disciplined to be a boxer. You have to be responsible because in the gym, coming in the gym every day is your responsibility. Nobody's going to force you to do what you need to do. But when you come in and do what you need to do, on a consistent basis, somebody's going to take a, a liking to you and start teaching you and showing you different things. So really to be a boxer, the main thing you need is discipline and consistency. Do I have a favorite pair of gloves? I've seen the winning gloves, I've seen the Grant gloves, I've seen all of them. My personal favorite is the mob gloves. <laughs> you know, the Mark Owens boxing gloves, we got everything here. We got boxing gloves, we got wraps, we got everything. This is the spot and I love my gloves. What's my thoughts about the boxing community in Texas? Um, in Texas, we have a great boxing community. We have some a bunch of stars, a bunch of champions in boxing. Uh, on a lower level professional um, scene, it's a, it's a bit rough. You know, getting started in boxing unless you're a big name, coming straight out the Olympics or something. Uh, but other than that, it's a grind. Just like everything else. You start from the bottom, you raise your way up to the top. But there's a bunch of guys that, that'll help you along the way. Uh, got Coach Aaron, uh, myself, Coach Tor, Bobby. Like, it's a bunch of guys that you could get with and really will guide you the right way. But Everything requires work. If you come in Texas trying to box thinking that you're just going to go straight off of hands alone, you're in trouble. You're in trouble. So boxing in Texas is boxing, just like football in Texas is football. <laughs> There's no games to be played in Texas. How did I come up with the name of my company? Y'all know the name of my company. It's the mob. But M.O.B., Mark Owens Boxing. I'm Mark Owens. I've been boxing all my life. <laughs> what, what, what other brand could I use? I'm like Big Meech and BMF. <laughs> nah, but for real, it just made a, a bunch of sense. And really, it wasn't even my idea. Um, a guy along the way uh, really pushed it, pushed it. Like, you need to go with the mob. Um, me personally, the MOB thing, I was kind of nervous about how people would take that. But worked out perfectly. It's who I am. It's where I am. Mark Owens Boxing. What was the most challenging part about opening up a boxing gym? What they say, location, location, location. <laughs> so my boxing gym, uh, Mark Owens Boxing Gym, so I've been at other boxing gyms, um, downtown or whatnot, but what I was trying to bring was something for the community. So really getting that centralized location in a community was was pretty challenging and then after we get the location which was a whole god thing in my situation uh after we get the location then you got to fund that location so opening up a boxing gym opening up a business i think the hardest part about it is the funding if you're not just coming in the game with a big bag you gotta work 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 push 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 it's entrepreneurship it's nothing to be played with it's a lot of work uh, so, that, in my opinion, that would be the hardest thing about opening up the boxing gym is mainly the funding. When people come to Mark Owens Boxing the Box, what can they expect? They're going to burn a ton of calories. You're going to learn a lot about boxing. 
And if you jump out there, you might get punched in the face. <laughs> but listen, this is a lot more than a, than a gym. Uh, people come and they really um, grow and really establish relationships. We have a lot of entrepreneurs that come to this gym. Um, just by being in this gym, a lot of people then started different careers, then found their careers. Mark Owens Boxing, True Ringers, what I'm about is about purpose. It's about helping people find their purpose. Boxing, relieving stress. Um, I'm about people. I'm not just about a product. I'm about people. Do I have more than one location at Mark Owens Boxing? Currently, it's one location. Now, the reason for the one location right now is to keep the atmosphere correct, to keep the atmosphere right, because Mark Owens can't be all over. Can't be in more than one place at one time. So right now, we are cultivating um, a relationship, cultivating an environment, and maybe we'll grow from there. But right now, this is the only location. My 6346 Beverly Hill Street, Houston, Texas. Join the mob. How is Mark Owens Boxing giving back to the community? True ringleaders. We feed the homeless on Fridays. We have uh, a ton of events. Y'all know the events. Y'all have seen the events. A lot of y'all have been at the events. Uh, we do community cleanups. We really, 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 really concentrate on mentoring the youth. That's mainly, that's our number one goal is mentoring the youth. But through that mentoring, we get a lot of work done. With the, with the mentees that we have, we do things like clean up the community. We try to take these kids outside of the community to see different things. We are pouring into in this community by pouring into the people. We are making better people to make a better community. And that's exactly what we're doing at Mark Owens Boxing. Where can the world find Mark Owens Boxing on social media? At Mark Owens Boxing. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok. Man, we got everything. It's Mark Owens Boxing. All y'all got to do is type it in, at Mark Owens Boxing. You want a great workout, you want a great experience, you want to grow, you want to be a great trainer, come holler at me. Join the mob. What advice could I give someone looking up to me? Understand that I'm not a complete package. I've been through a lot. As you know, 10 years incarcerated, uh, five years in the military, coming from a not so good background. Uh, I never quit. I never quit. And it was never easy for me. Nothing about life is easy. But if you're looking up to me, learn from me, take from what I know, take from what I've experienced. Uh, don't make the same stupid mistakes that I've made. In my past, I've tried to take a lot of shortcuts. And, I shut, and a lot of shortcuts got me to the wrong place fast. That's all a shortcut do. Um, so if you take anything from me, the biggest thing, the biggest thing anyone could take from me uh, is that I love the Lord. I love the Lord. Like, like God, God then led me the entire way. Uh, my foolishness, I was leading me. Once I got it together and really established a, race, a relationship and uh, start moving the right way, yeah, yeah, just not quitting.